In my opinion, the best content creators always try to find ways to engage their community and interact with them. On Twitch, a really great way to do this is the channel points. Basically, people can redeem them for different rewards. Right now, at the making of this video though, they're super limited. They don't let you trigger things like sounds or images. So I wanted to find a way to make channel points even better and find a way to make them super interactive. Today, I'm gonna to teach you guys how to really make your channel points stand out and set them up to trigger alerts. By the end of this video, you guys will have channel point rewards that let you trigger things like sounds, music, and images. All right, let's upgrade some channel points. For those of you who don't know me, my name's Michael. I'm a streamer, content creator, and designer from Atlanta, Georgia. I've been trying to make my stream better and more interactive, and hopefully this guide can kind of help you guys do the same. If you guys have any questions about this video or any of my other videos, feel free to stop by the Twitch. I stream every Tuesday, Thursday at 8 p.m. Eastern time. Also, if you guys find anything in this video useful or helpful, please leave a like and subscribe. It really does help me out and I appreciate it. Okay, so first things first, let's talk about what you guys are gonna need to actually do this. You're gonna need a plugin called Triggerfire and then you're also gonna need to be using Stream Elements OBS. All the links and resources that you guys need are gonna be down in the description box below. Okay, so the first step in this is to open up the Discord link that I dropped down below. That's going to take you to the Triggerfire Discord. Once you're here, you're going to want to go to Updates and you're going to click on this link for the GitHub page. This is going to pull up the plugin that you need to download for Triggerfire to work with OBS. Okay, so once you're here, you're going to scroll down and you're going to look for the uh, Windows installer and you're just going to click on that. Once you download that, just follow the steps of the setup until you're done. Okay, once you're through with that, you can close out of this window. And now we're gonna go to the dump channel in the Triggerfire Discord. Once you're in the dump, you're gonna wanna type in exclamation mark Triggerfire. What this is gonna do is it's gonna allow you to see the Triggerfire beta um, channel that lets you download the other things that you need. Okay, so once you do that, you're gonna go to the Triggerfire beta you're gonna click on the pinned messages in the top right, and you're just gonna scroll down to the bottom. Okay, so these are the last two things you're gonna need. Um, you're gonna click on the uh, Welcome to Triggerfire dashboard and open that up. And then you're gonna click on the uh, Stream Elements plugin. Or the Stream Elements overlay, excuse me. Okay, cool. So now once you've done that, you're gonna go over to Triggerfire, the dashboard. You're gonna log in with your Twitch information. And then right here, you can see you have images, videos, sounds. For all of these, you guys now have the capability to make channel points rewards that activate things like sounds, videos, and images. Okay, so today we're gonna to be making a sound alert. You can do whatever you want. The process is pretty much the same. As you can see, I was kind of playing around with this R2-D2 sound, but today we're just gonna be making a, another sound alert. You're gonna come into this bottom uh, right-hand corner and click the plus. We're gonna be doing a, a C3PO to, to go with our R2-D2, but just type in the name, C3PO. Okay, so this part is important. You're going to come to this little, it looks like a money sign to me, but click on that. And whatever you name this here has to be the same name as the channel points reward. So we're just going to name it C3PO again, but just make sure this matches exactly what the channel points reward is. Also, you do have the option to allow this as a command so people can just use the command. But if you want it to be tied to channel points and you don't want people to be able to spam it, then just go ahead and leave that unchecked. Okay, we're gonna click save. All right, now we're gonna select our sound. So whatever you decided to do, whether that's image, video, sound, whatever, just upload your file that you need from your computer. So ours is gonna be in sounds. Okay, cool. So here's here's our RT, or C3PO. We're gonna upload that. Just click the check mark. Okay, let's test our sound effect. You watch your language. Okay, works great. And then what you're gonna to wanna to do is click save. So once you've saved your sound effect or image or video or whatever you're doing, you're gonna come down to the right hand corner again and you're gonna click this pink little gear. Now, you're gonna to wanna to copy this token. This token's important because it's gonna allow a trigger fire to communicate with stream elements. 
So once you have that token, you're going to go over to the stream elements page, stream elements page, excuse me. Um, you're going to go to edit the overlay that you got from trigger fire. You're going to click here and you're going to go to settings and then you're going to go to widget token. And then you're, you're going to enter your widget token that you just copied right here. Okay. So you're going to save that. Now, two things we need to do before this is going to be able to work. One is we're going to have to go over to Twitch right here. You're going to go to creator dashboard, this little hamburger menu, community, and then channel points. And you're going to do uh, manage rewards and we're going to create a new uh, reward. So add new custom reward. Remember, this name has to be exactly the same as the trigger fire name. So we named it here. Let's check. We named it C3PO, so let's just copy that. Save, save. And we're gonna put that right here. Okay, so now it's the exact same. We're gonna enter an amount. We'll just do 500. Okay, great. So there's our C3PO. You're gonna click, click create. So now you have the command created here. You have it tied to trigger fire. Now we're gonna go back to stream elements. You're gonna click on uh, save and you're gonna click copy the URL to add this to OBS. And then you're gonna open up your OBS. You're gonna come down to here and you're gonna to wanna to add a new, a new browser source. So go browser, create new, we'll just call it uh, C3PO for now. Cool. Let's check what it is. So let's see, okay, 1100 by 750. Let's add that in here, 1100 by 750. Okay, and then you're gonna add the URL you copied right here. If you guys have made overlays before, you know how to do this, um, but just click okay. Okay, so now it is in OBS, and now everything should work, guys. So basically what we're gonna do is, I'm gonna pull this off screen. I'm going to uh, exit out of stream elements, exit out of trigger fire. We're going to go to our Twitch chat. Okay, and let's uh, let's test it out. So if we do C3PO right here, it should play our sound. Let's try it. You watch your language. Okay, so there we go. You guys now have your own custom alert that can be redeemed with channel points. Super cool plugin that I really think can, can upgrade your channel points and really bring them to a new level. And you guys can get really creative with this. I mean, I'm just using them for sound effects right now, but like I said, you know, you can use them for images, videos, get crazy guys, make some really cool stuff. Again, if you guys have any questions of how to set this up, or if you just wanna to talk to me about stream stuff or design stuff, please stop by the Twitch. The Discord is also a great place to get answers or just stay up to date with what's going on. We have a great little community over there and we would love to see you. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Go make some amazing Channel Point rewards, be creative, and have a great day. And we've got Wind Song in here. Wingdings? No, I want Wind Song. Hey, there we go. That's that's better. That's better. I like that. That's pretty good. That's pretty good, dude.